Good morning, how y'all doing today? Just gonna do a quick video on a quick review on the new EZV bow sight. And uh, I just ordered this thing. Um, I hadn't had a ton of time to sit down and actually, you know, get everything just perfect. I've been kind of busy, but um, I'm impressed, I'm telling you. Um, here's the sight, all right? It's not like your uh, your traditional pin sights. It's just a V. Here's like here's your actual view. Now, if you look, there are if you can see it, there's little black lines on there. I call them tick marks. All right, and to get it sighted in, this little insert will come out, and you get like eight different inserts um, when you buy it. Okay, and uh, anyway you uh, get the correct insert it's got a number on there and that's uh, what speed your arrow is shooting all right or your bow shooting so anyway if you've got a, a ballpark idea of what speed your bow shooting put that insert in and uh, that'll get you pretty close but anyway throw that insert in there all right and then to sight it in that top that top tick line it's gonna be your 20 yards. So you sight it in at 20 yards, and basically what you're doing is you're putting the bullseye in between those that V, you just frame it up. And your, your mind will put that arrow right in between there. Your mind, however it works, will put that thing left and right in the center, all right? And then as the V goes down, you know, that's, you're getting further and further away. But basically, um, you need to watch the videos on, the, on their channel. Um, they're a lot more in-depth than what I'm going to do. I, I'm just impressed with the site. But um, anyway, this basically just does away with the need for uh, a rangefinder. And you just... Once you get it dialed in and sighted in, and I mean, it's it only took a couple of minutes to put it on. Um, you know, you got to do a little bit of a little bit of tweaking, you know, left and right, up and down, very little. It's it's easily adjustable. But once you get it sighted in, basically what you're doing is framing the vitals, which you know we're just going to say roughly the size of a basketball. All right, so if you're at 60 yards, you just move that basketball size vitals. To where it's you know into that V and frame it up and just let it go. I mean you you can be at 40 yards, 45 yards, 52 yards. It don't matter. You just and and you'll train your mind. It, it it works weird, but you just frame that up in between those V's and uh, and it it puts it there. I mean you know it's, it's crazy how it works, but it does work. Um, like I say you sitting there in your tree and all of a sudden boom you look over there's a big buck there you know and he comes in he's on full alert he's looking around he knows somebody's there well ordinarily you know you try and get a few yardages before you uh you know before you ever start hunting anyway but um you're probably gonna want to get out you you got to dig for your range finder and then you got to get it out and you got to ease it up and then you got to get a yardage and you got to make sure that yardage is right because it did you know make sure it didn't hit a limb or a leaf and give you the wrong yardage and then you got to put it back in there. and then you got to get ready well now when he steps out there forget the range finder leave the range finder at home draw back frame it and claim it that's what they say and it actually works i mean it is crazy uh, the guy aaron lasco that uh that came up with it um, he's, he's, man, he's put a lot of thought into this thing. So, anyway, um, I'm going to shoot a couple of times, and we'll just see how it goes. Like I say, I'm no expert. I'm just getting started, but, I mean, it's, it's pretty simple, and it, it's amazing. But anyway, uh, let's, uh, let's shoot a couple of times, and like I say, I, I, I'm just going to step somewhere. I have no idea what the yardage is, but I'm just going to give you an idea. This is going to be roughly... It's between uh, 35 and 40 yards, something like that. But I mean, I'm 
I'm just framing it up. I'm, I'm not looking at any yardage indicators. I'm just using the V's, all I'm doing. Oh, the other thing, yeah. Once uh, once you get everything figured out, uh, you can uh, do what they call GoPro. Uh, you can take this and flip it around to where you don't have those black lines anymore. Or you can shoot it with the black lines, it's up to you. But you turn around there, I mean, you know, you don't, you don't have to worry about your order or anything, but I'm just shooting it uh, in, you know, the way you sight it in. But anyway, here we go. I'm going to shoot a couple of times. We'll see. Like I said, no idea uh, what the yardage is. I'm just going to shoot. Also, keep in mind, um, you can get really good with this site. Um, like I said, I'm just getting started, but this, uh, this site, it, it really isn't designed to be a tack driver, like something you would use to shoot, you know, 3D with. Um, it's basically, it's just gonna, it's gonna put you in the vitals every time, you know, no matter what the yardage is. Um, and target acquisition is so much quicker. I mean, before you're having to put that, put that pin on the bullseye and it's doing this and you're waiting and holding for it to you know to get right and wait until it gets to that perfect spot and then you squeeze the trigger with that V it, it eliminates target panic um, it, it just makes everything so much quicker you just put it up there get it about right I mean it's, it's that easy um, it's crazy I mean <laughs> I love it Like I say, that's, you know, somewhere between 35, 40 yards, something like that. And let's go see how close it got me. That's not using any tick marks or anything. That's just imagining, you know, where the, where the vitals are at. Alright, and there it is. I mean... You know, just a hair high, but it's dead center. And, uh, I mean, man, that's a dead deer. You know, that's, uh, that's in the vitals all day long. And no range finder. So, I don't know. I mean, to me, it's just, keep it simple, stupid. I mean, it's just, it's pretty, pretty amazing what that thing will do. Um... Like I say, it, it, it mounts right up to, you know, where your old sight goes. You got your uh, up and down there. And then on the front, you got a screw. And that'll do your left and your right. And then uh, you have to kind of square your sight up as you, as you move it up and down. You have to kind of square it up to your eye. You know, rotate it. You know, rotate it uh, kind of this way a little bit and uh, get it square to the eye because if not you know it'll be kind of at an angle or whatever but anyway um like i say uh, man the whole idea of uh not having to worry about yardage because i mean you know as well as i do most of the time if you miss a deer it's like well i thought he was at you know i thought he was at 40 and i shot him for 32 or you know he was at 32 and i shot him for 40. so uh I mean, the whole idea of not having to worry about that anymore. Um, doing away with all your yardage, you know, throw your range finder away. Don't don't worry about how far that deer's. All right, say you ranged him and he was at 40 yards. Well, by the time you get your range finder back in your pocket and uh, get your bow ready to shoot, well, he's done took 10 more steps. I mean, you know, how far is he now? You got to guess at it. Now your mind is sitting there thinking, you know, well, okay, how far is he now? What's the yardage on him? What pin should I put on him? You don't have to do that anymore. Just frame it and claim it. I mean, it's it's really that easy. And the more I'm practicing with it, the, the more I'm loving it. I mean, it's, it's awesome. <laughs>
so anyway uh like i said go check out their uh uh, their YouTube page, um, EZV Bow Site. Pretty sure that's it. Um, they got a a face group, uh, face group, Facebook page. Uh, it's called uh, EZV Evolution. And anyway, go check it out. It's uh, it's definitely worth uh, worth checking them out. Watch all the videos. See what you think. Um, like I say, I've man, I've been hunting for bow hunting for. Uh, 30 something years I guess and always shot pins and I don't know man this is this is a game changer here um, I love it so anyway if I don't convince you go go watch some of the other videos I mean it's there's a few people you know I've seen that gave reviews that they didn't care for it but you know there's Nothing you're ever going to see on the internet that everybody's going to be happy with. But I'm telling you, the majority of the people just absolutely love this site. And I'm telling you, I, I think it's going to be the next big thing. So, anyway, y'all go check them out. All right. Remember, frame it and claim it. The V. <laughs> All right, y'all be good. Peace.